So let me just label them first. Let's say yeah. A, B, C. Now please explain. Okay, so since the uh, isosceles uh, triangle has two sides at the same uh, point, so other side will be five as well, five centimeters. So make sure you write this thing. So yes. you will write AB equals to AC equals to five centimeter isosceles triangle property to gain full marks. Okay. Okay. Now, in this case, I need to find X, the third side. How can I find that? So one yes. angle is given. If you have all the three sides of the world, so oh, sorry, two two sides and one angle, always use cos formula. Okay. Okay. So cos formula is always same thing. C square equals to A square plus B square minus 2AB cos C. C. Always remember to start off with the last part. Can you tell me what is the angle given in this question? Uh, 51 degrees. So we'll start from there. Cos 51 degree. Okay. Now, op opposite to this 51 degree is okay. 5. So this becomes my C. This becomes my oh, C. C. Understood? Yeah, because it's opposite to that. That's opposite. Yeah. Now, A and B are the other two sides. Is that thing clear? Yeah. So now, in this particular question, A is my 5 and B is what? x x square minus 2 into 5 into x clear now after that use n solve to tell the answer simple okay. is that thing clear yes so n solve is the best tool possible for you guys and that will be done quickly copy this thing So sin A upon A, over here, the angle is angle ACB. So basically we need to find this angle. Mm -hmm. Yes or no? Yeah. So we don't have A and A both. So mm -hmm. we will delete this part. We'll focus on the other. So mm -hmm. sin B, what is the B value over, over here? B value is uh, 20 meters. But a sine B, angle I'm asking. Oh, 37 sorry, degrees. 37 degrees, yes. Uh, upon 20 and sine C, we need to find C. And C value is 15. So always remember in this kind of fraction, we have to use only any two fractions. Like right now, sine A upon A was there, but I deleted them. Yes, because A wasn't there. Yeah. Both the things were not there. Okay. Yeah. So, over here, once you write this thing, you can use uh, your n solve and find out. Right now, also, you can find out sine 37 degree into 15. Don't write at the end. Uh, 15, you should write in the beginning. Upon 20. And everything in sine inverse. Okay. So if yeah. you solve this thing, you will get the angle over here. I think n solve is better. I think this game confused a bit. Yes, use n solve. Now over here also we will use sine root sine a upon a sine b upon b sin c upon c. What do we need to find? We need to find ac. So we have to include that thing. Mm -hmm. So sin a. Do we have angle a? No. Do no. we have side a? Side a is opposite. 
this side is B, this side is C. Yes, so we don't. Uh -huh. So we don't use this thing, yeah. cancel this thing. Yeah. Sign B, do we have angle B? Um, angle B. 58 degree. Yeah, 58. Angle B, 58 degree. And side B, we need to find that. Mm -hmm. Sign C. 30, 39. 39 degree and opposite to that 12 same. yeah yeah so again you can just use n solve if you don't want to use n solve just cross multiply 12 sine 58 degree upon sine 39 degree equals to b so if you solve this thing you will be able to get the value of b Okay. Okay. So quickly copy this thing. Yeah. 